Hey campers, this is Pastor Rick coming to you from Camp Table Rock. And I'm so glad that you've decided to uh, join us for our Staff Devo series uh, this year. Um, we want so much to be a continued source of encouragement to you all throughout the year. You know, we love it when you're at, at camp. We have so much fun and, and it, we enjoy worshiping with you and growing in our faith with you. But we want you to know that when you leave camp, you don't leave our hearts. You don't leave our minds. We think about you. We pray for you. We believe in you. And we want so much to be a part of your life as you're on your mission field every day. So I hope that this staff devotional series uh, will do that for you as we reach out to you through the area of social media. In John the 18th chapter, we see Jesus standing before Pilate. And in verse 37, Jesus says, Everyone on the side of truth listens to me. To which Pilate responds in verse 38, what is truth? That question, what is truth, is still being asked to this day. People are searching everywhere for truth. We look for it in education, but we don't find it. We look for it in wealth and popularity, but we don't find it. We look for it in pleasure, but we don't find it. We look for it in social media, but we don't find it. We look for it in the entertainment media, and we don't find it there either. According to George Barner Research, 74% of millennials believe this. Whatever is right for your life, or works best for you, is the only truth you can know. Really? That statistic is one of the saddest things I've ever heard. Jesus said, then you will know the truth, and the truth will set you free. We have the truth. It's right in front of us. All we have to do is pick up our Bibles and read truth. George Barna also says in his research that Americans 18 years of age and older are worried that moral behavior has become a thing of the past. It's no wonder we are worried. Without a source of absolute truth, there can be no morality. In Psalm 119, verse 105, we find these words, Your word is a lamp unto my feet and a light unto my path. Without the light of God's word guiding our lives, we are lost. We will never find truth. I know if you've been to camp, you've probably heard me say it a thousand times. We must read, know, and memorize God's Word. It is our only source of absolute truth. Would you pray with me? Heavenly Father, God, I just ask that you'd open our hearts and our minds to your truth. God, I pray that you would create a hunger in every single one of us for your Word, which is our only source of eternal truth. God, I pray that we would read it, that it would truly become a light unto our path, and a lamp unto our feet, and God, that it would truly set us free in a world that is desperate to find truth. You have given us the source of eternal truth through your word. God, please help us. Help us to read it, help us to believe it, and help us to live it. I ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. Know God's truth. Believe God's truth and live God's truth. Stand strong. We love you guys.